me or whenever I do a Bloxburg hack, it feels like I'm cheating in the game. Now, I'm not talking about actual cheats like this person who literally got an auto farmer to make his house. Uh, please don't get those because that will get you banned. And yeah, don't, don't do that, guys. Uh, I'm talking about some normal hacks or things that Bloxburg has added that feels like you're cheating. So I asked my Discord server, what are some Bloxburg hacks that feel like you're cheating in Bloxburg? And well, we got a lot of answers. So let's see what I think. Uh, eating toes. Uh, I love toes. Don't clip that. Okay, <laughs> moving on. Glitching through walls. Now, Bloxburg glitching through walls has been a thing for a while, and there's multiple ways on how to glitch through a wall. I mean, you can break into houses very easily. I mean, one big way that a lot of people know how to do is glitching through a door. We also have another one where you can take bubble gum, which was probably my favorite. I think you still need a door for this one. I actually don't remember, to be honest. But I'm just gonna put a door anyways. And then we also need a candy bucket. So let's get that candy bucket for that. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not the best at glitching through walls. So don't mind me. This might not work for myself. But guys, I swear you can glitch through walls. And it does feel like I'm cheating, okay? But all you wanna do is come to the door. And then you wanna go ahead and sit down. And then I think we like rotate this way or something. And then we like jump. It, it's, a, it's a lot of work. Okay, wait, guys. I can do this. I'm gonna show you guys the bubblegum hack first. I don't even think you need a door for the bubblegum hack, to be honest. But what you wanna do for the bubblegum hack is that you eat the bubblegum and then when you blow a bubble you should be able to yes uh, oh nope it didn't work okay maybe did they patch this i don't think they patched this i'm just really bad at it guys i literally made a video on this a while ago when this came out and it took me so long to figure out how to do it okay yeah i'm just really bad at breaking through doors okay anyways a uh, long story short even though i can't do it breaking through walls or walking through walls definitely feels like i'm cheating in blocksburg probably when you type in a color it feels like hacking so i think this means that by going into build mode going to color and then coloring something up and we have a color coloring thing but i keep forgetting we have a color wheel where you can actually type in a what color you want and it does sort of feel like hacking because i can literally get any any shade i want which i totally forget this thing exists i'm not gonna lie like this is too much customization for me but let me know if you guys feel like you're cheating if you get random colors or your custom colors basically all right what's next what else do you guys sitting in glitching true 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 apple slash orange tree farming now i'm pretty sure this orange tree farm has been patched because as you can see people made this like years ago four years ago two years ago and this was like the most recent one which riot made um and it's a berry bush farm so i think the new cheat is to get a berry bush farm so if you guys do want a cheat on how to make a bunch of money you can get six hundred thousand dollars a day apparently go watch this video but having very complex farms i can see why that feels like cheating because you're getting so much money by doing absolutely nothing well you're doing something but this also brings me to the next thing that makes blogsburg feel like it, you're cheating is buying money i mean not really just buying money just having a lot of money now i have oh, an absurd amount of money but a couple people said that having money is is a, basically a cheat because you can get whatever and anything that you want. And, you know, I think money... Money in Bloxburg is like money in real life. Without money, you can't do anything. And Bloxburg is so expensive if you go to decorate over here and go to all. Like, the cheapest thing is a pile of trash for $10, guys. Like, there should be a dollar, okay? And money. You have to buy money with money for $20. Like, maybe it's a $20 bill, though. But, like, that's crazy. Also, a marker. 30 bucks for a marker? Insane. So, if you ain't rich in Bloxburg, you're, you're not cheating. <laughs> all right, let's see what else. So we have a Skibibbity Toilet Riz. I don't know. Okay, I don't know about that one, but all right. Uh, custom window hack. Uh, I think custom window hack really goes in with someone else said uh, using structural and basic shapes. I can't really find it, but uh, this one I totally agree with, guys. Like, literally anything that you build with structural items over here or any of the basic shapes, it literally feels like I'm cheating because you can literally build anything that you want. Like, if I want to build a pyramid or, like, something that looks like Minecraft, I can. You know, like, I can literally build anything that i want uh, and it feels like i'm cheating the game because uh you know before they added structural items and before they added basic shapes uh, all you had were all these build items and uh, you remember hacks back then guys you had to use these items to build things but now you can just whip up a basic shape and boom you can build whatever you want uh, so as an og player i really feel like i'm cheating when i'm using basic shapes or structural items which i don't really use that often because they scare me but 
does feel like cheating. Like, I can build anything I want, guys. Anything I want. All right, let's see what else we have. Also, you can build custom windows and anything, basically, with the, the structural items and all. Um, it definitely feels like being too rich and uh, uh, people ask for your money and just being really good at building. Oh, so Abby, Abby's just good at everything. Abby's just amazing at everything. So she feels like she's cheating because she's superior at Bloxburg. You know what? Round of applause to Abby, guys. Comment down below a clap emoji for Abby. Using decals. A lot of people said using decals as well. Being able to make your own decals and uploading into Bloxburg. Loki, this also feels like a cheat, just like basic shapes because using them together, actually, you can do whatever you want. So if we go to decal here um, and you can make your own plants, like a lot of people have been using these for plants because you can make transparent stuff. So it definitely feels like cheating because you don't even have to build anymore, guys. You literally don't even have to build anymore. Like you want to, do you want to, you want a dog? You want a pet dog? Well, you just go ahead and over here and we can get ourselves a pet dog. Now, all of these are not transparent, but... Hold on, we can find one. Okay, what about this one? This one's cartoony, but look, now I have a pet dog, guys. You know, if Bloxburg won't add pets, I'm gonna add my own. But like, you can add whatever you want, guys, and you don't even have to build it. Easy Pazuzi. Easy Pazuzi? I don't think that's a word. I was trying to say easy peasy. Okay, never mind. Let's just do the next one. All right, next. Being able to color my bed sheets. Uh, what? I don't know about that one, but all right. Basic shape structural items. Uh, building custom things like ladders, everything custom, literally, literally. Custom walls, bro, no, literally custom walls are insane because people can't make half walls and people can now make half walls because of it. The only part that sucks about having custom walls is that you can't really put anything on it unless you like do basic shapes. I mean, like, it's just a lot of work. I'm not gonna lie, it's a lot of work to cheat in Bloxburg, but you can't. I have a whole mansion made out of basic shapes. I have no clue how you had the patience to do that because I could never. Using auto build schematics to copy a house from schematics rather than auto building it. Don't do that. That's actually hacking and cheating. Do not do that, guys. So I think that was like about seven or eight uh, ways that Bloxburg feel like, not Bloxburg. Guys, what am I saying? <laughs> it feels like you're cheating in Bloxburg using these hacks. Let me know if you guys feel like you're cheating in any way or form at doing these things uh, down in the comments below because I would love to know. But if also there's other things that I missed, let me know that as well. Um, but I do actually feel like cheating. You know, I never really had this uh, this uh, idea of like, oh my gosh, am I cheating? But now that I think of it, I think decals are the most cheat way of doing anything because you just put it on a decal and boom, you're done. You don't have to build it. You don't have to do anything. I love decals. I love decals, guys. They're the best. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm gonna hunt all the cheaters down. All right, I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna find you and I'm gonna ban you. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe, turn that notification on so you guys don't miss a video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.